Hey folks, Matt from RTheImage.com. We've got Gadgets247. That's a YouTube username written in. I've been using the D5200, Nikon D5200, for a couple years now and I absolutely love it. I use it for photography once in a while, but my main purpose is for videos. I want to buy an extra camera instead of hiring cameras for a second angle. Here in India, the D52 and D33 cost exactly the same. Should I pick up the 52 or the 33? Also, the D33 records 1080-60p, whereas the 52 records 1080-60i, so that's an advantage of the D3300. I also know, I wanted to know which camera performs better under low light conditions. Thanks. Okay, first off, we'll take the last part, low light. I don't think you're going to see a whole lot of difference, although I would probably give the nod to the 52 just off the top of my head from what I remember on performance from both of them. Um, the I would take the 52 simply because the swing out very angle LCD. Uh, that right there would clinch it for me. Um, I would probably, if it was me, get a used, refurbed, whatever you can get out there, D55, because I like the touch screen and the newer body. It's got that carbon fiber body. It inherits from the 750. So that's what I would go to. Um, if you're almost entirely about filmmaking, I really would consider, I don't know what it costs in India to get the G7s, but... That's what I'd seriously look at if I was you because the G7 4K advantage is head and tails over any of these cameras. So that's what I'd seriously look at because in the States, 597 for the G7 and a lens um, at a fast prime like the, um, well, if you add the 42.5 F17, that's all you need. Gives you a beautiful portrait camera for doing portraits and fantastic field of view. Add the 50 F17 too. It's you know, under two hundred dollars. That's where that's where I would go. That's what I'm shooting with right now, and I have um, a fifty five hundred available at a six hundred and an eight ten for video. Though I love the four K files out of the G seven. Really looking forward to see the four K out of the D five hundred and the D five. Um, but that's not what we're talking about here. So I'm just throwing in it as an option. But between the two, you're suggesting fifty two and thirty three. I go for the fifty two. Um, because it's a better, more advanced body, and I really love the very angle LCD, especially for filmmaking. I use it for photography too, but what do you guys think? Leave some comments below. Do you agree with me? Disagree? Why? Um, thanks for your question, Gadgets 24-7, and um, stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at artoftheimage.com.